Welcome to JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Jamie Scotto Kataya of JSA. Here joining me at ITW 2016, we have Juan Salazar. He's the CEO and CTO of McAllen Data Centers. Juan, thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. So I hear your facility is doubling in size. What is uh, leading up to all this expansion? Well, McAllen uh, sits in the right on the border with Mexico. So we have a lot of uh, international carriers mm -hmm. that are uh, trying to get into Mexico, open that new market. So um, we're kind of a hub, but we have Mexican carriers coming up and uh, co-locating in our facility. And then uh, we have international carriers, American and international, come down and uh, co-locate as well. So that's where they both interconnect. And then the growth of IP services in Mexico is really what's been driving uh, our expansion. And I know that your tagline is protected and connected. So how do you guys safeguard your clients' networks? Uh, well, protected and connected is kind of uh, the very summary of what we do. Uh, at our core, we really provide two services. The first one is interconnection. Mm -hmm. um, and that's what I was kind of talking about, where uh, carers come down and they want to know who is in our facility so they can buy and sell services. That's really our, our reason for being. And uh, the second service is uh, co-location. So carers uh, want to know that if they're sending millions of dollars worth of equipment, mm -hmm. that uh, it's, it's in a secure facility, uh, it's being run uh, as a data center should. Um, and we really understand that when carers choose to co-locate with MDC, uh, they're really uh, entrusting us you know, with their equipment and also with their brand because uh, we're a link in their supply chain and you know, any, any failure that we have reflects on our customers so, so we take the responsibility uh, very seriously. Yeah, a critical link, a critical link in their, in their uh, chain there. So what are your other unique benefits for your target customers? Well, mostly uh, what we do is is help bring these customers together. Mm -hmm. uh, I think the uh, the main thing that that we offer is what we call like business advocacy. Mm -hmm. So we don't uh, you know just kind of sit back or, or sell a call. We try and bring these opportunities together uh, because we are carrier neutral. You know, we're uh, our only intent is to help uh, new customers uh, make their business case, really. So I think that's the biggest thing that we do. So whenever I have CEOs sitting in the hot chair like I have with you here, I like to ask them to look into their crystal ball and tell us what can we expect from McAllen in the next 6 to 12 months? Um, well, we're working on several projects right now. Um, but uh, I guess the, the common thread to all these projects is is how do we make our customer experience better? How do we minimize their risk and, uh, and their costs? Uh, so uh, some of these new projects, I think Joel will probably share some of that, uh, they have that common thread to them. Yeah, and it's, it definitely sounds like you are so customer focused, very, uh, you know, customer is, is, is driving everything that you do from safeguarding their networks to uh, their cost and, and, uh, and uh, connectivity. So really uh, excited. Where, where can our interested viewers and listeners go to find out more information? Well, I think uh, the first place is uh, our website, so uh, mcallendc.com is uh, our website, and uh, of course all of our social channels. Uh, that's pretty, probably the best place to start. Thank you so much, Juan, for joining Thank us. And Thanks for having me. And mcallendc.com, check it out. Thank you viewers for tuning in to JSA TV. Thank you.